The question is, there are 40 children in Gautam's class. 3 over 8 of them are in the playground. How many children of his class are in the playground? So it's already said 3 by 8 of them are in the playground. Again it is asked how many children of his class are in the playground. Cannot I write 3 by 8 of them are in playground? That means 3 by 8 children are in playground? No, I can't write that. Please read the question line by line. The first line, let us focus on the first line. The first line says there are 40 children in Gautam's class. So let us try to visualize that. Here is a classroom. This is Gautam's class and there are 40 children in the class. Okay. All right. Now it says 3 by 8 of them are in the playground. So some children from Gotham's class are in the playground. Now we have to find out how many children of his class are in the playground. For that, let us make this playground. And since it has been said 3 by 8, so let us make 8 groups. Let us divide the playground. into eight sections okay so how many are there let me just write the numbers this is one two three four five six seven eight the entire playground is divided into eight sections now, if I, if there are 40 children and if I divide the playground into 8 sections, so how many children will be there in each section? 40 divided by 5? Five? 5. So, let me put the children in groups. So, in the first column, we have four, 5 children, then 10 children, 15. In each column, we are having 5 children. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. Okay. So, all the 14 children. 40 children are now in the playground. But according to our question, all the children, all the 40 children are not there in the playground. How many children are there? Only 3 by 8 of them. That means out of all these 8 groups, only 3 groups are there in the playground. And the rest are not there. These people, the rest other five groups are not there in the playground. So, let us just remove them. Alright, now can you count? How many are there? 3 by 8 of 40 children is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 in each group. So, there are 3 groups. It should be 15. Let us just count and see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. There are 15 children present in the playground and the rest are not there. But should we make a box and keep children and then count it? No, we should do the mathematics in a simpler way. How to do that? There are 40 children in Gotham's class. 3 by 8 of them are in the playground. Okay, so. 3 by 8 of them. Let us focus on this thing. 3 by 8 of them. When you see of in your question, do you know what does that mean? Of means multiplication. And what is this them? Them means 3 by 5, sorry, 3 by 8 out of the 40 children. So in place of 3 by 8, I can write 3 by 8. In place of of, we can write multiply and in place of them, we can write 40. Now, if we cancel it, if we do the fraction multiplication, so 40 means 40 divided by 1. Now, we can cancel the numerator 40 with the denominator 8. Five, uh, 8 is a common factor for both 40 and 8. 8 times 1 is 8. 8 times 5 is 40. We do not have anything more to cancel. So, we will multiply our numerator with the numerator. That is 3 multiplied by 5. We get 15. And we will multiply our denominator with the denominator. That is 1 times 1. We get 1. In the denominator, if we have 1, we do not write that. So, 
our answer will be 15. In the answer statement, we can just write 15 children are there in the playground.